Ed says after getting out of jail, he only has one thing in his mind. Uh, what is that? Oh, I'm here, Jerry, because uh, I got out of jail not too long ago. Yep. You know, I went to the house, took a shower, you know, did what I had to do. Yeah. I tried to call my brother, you know, because I hadn't heard from him in a while. Yeah. Well, he didn't answer, so I went to his house. I knocked on the door, and a, a woman named Ashley answered. You know, she's kind of, she's a little healthy, got big breasts. <laughs> she yeah. got a pretty face. I asked who she was, and she said she was my brother's fiance. Ooh. Okay. I said, fiance, well, she invited me in, you know, we sat on the couch, we talked, had conversation. I asked her where my brother was, she said he was at work, she asked me if I was working. I told her, no, you know, I was looking for work because I had just got out of jail. Sure. Well, she said, you know, she might have some odd and end things around the house I could do. She said, Streety works so much. Streety? Oh, that's, my that's brother. your brother. Yes, sir. Okay, Streety. That he yeah. works so much that, you know, if something needs fixed, he really didn't have time to do it. So she took my number, I took hers, I left, you know, we departed. I left. A couple days later, I was at the bar with one of my friends. We was drinking a little bit, and she texted me. I got a text from her, and she said the sink was messed up. The sink was leaking real bad. Oh. So Could I you left. come over to fix the sink? Yes. Yeah. So I left the did bar. You, did you bring your plumbing tools with you? Well, I brought a few of them. Yeah. Uh, Bet you did. I knocked on the door. She answered. She had on a towel. Nothing but a towel, so I guess oh. she had just got out the shower. Oh, she might, yeah. She let me upstairs, show me where the sink was. It was leaking pretty bad. There was water everywhere. Oh, you can imagine. That's what I she got had down, the towel on, yeah. I got down to work on the sink. I was working on the sink. Next thing I know, I felt somebody reach for my zipper. Oh, so, oh. So I leaned up. I almost hit my head. I leaned up so well, fast. yeah. I was in shock. Yeah. Uh, she wow. unbuttoned my pants, she started kissing on my neck. I'd been drinking, you know, my neck's my sensitive spot. Oh, yeah. I'd been no, drinking. No, I didn't know that, but go ahead, yeah. I'd <laughs> been drinking, next thing I know, we was on the floor, water was going everywhere, and we was having sex. Oh. Oh, my God. Oh, your brother now knows, because he's watching backstage. Here's your brother, Streety. <laughs> always busy working and you're never at home and I mean so I you go like sleep with somebody who don't have a job <laughs> who can't do nothing for you well he helps around the house when helps I around call. the house I mean yeah they're still messed up to this day <laughs> we got busy. but helps now your mom I say something and I, apparently we have it on video is that it let's take a look you need to grow up Streety you need to get away from big mama because all she wants is your paycheck every week and Ed you need to stay away from Big Mama, too. You don't even have a job. Why don't you go off for her? Y'all are brothers. Y'all are all each other's guys, so you need to stop and get away from her before I come over there and put her out her own apartment. Now, do what your mama tells you, because mama always know best. What do you think of what mama said? Mom might be right. Might just be best if we go our separate ways. <laughs>